Hi Cougars, I'm Max along with Zach and this is the Cougar Campus News. Congratulations to the juniors for winning first place at the homecoming lip sync contest yesterday at lunch. Woo! Following closely behind in second place were the freshmen. The sophomores finished in third place and the seniors in last place. For overall points in homecoming so far, the freshmen are in last place. In third place are the seniors, the sophomores are in second place, and the juniors lead the pack in first place. But there are still many more homecoming events to add to the score, with the red carpet and the dance competitions at the assembly tomorrow. Attendance will be counted at the varsity football game tomorrow night and at the homecoming dance on Saturday. So really, the bragging rights for homecoming champs are still up for grabs. Good luck to all classes. Attention seniors. As a reminder, the local scholarship application is due November 17th by 3.30 p.m. We highly encourage all students to fill out the application on Naviance. These scholarships will be available to students who are applying to career technical education, community college, CSU, and UC slash privates. Cougars, thank you for all those donations to the fire victims of Sonoma and Napa County. FFA will continue with providing aid for the fire victims, but they're changing their plans. For now, we are no longer collecting items, but stay tuned and we will announce how you can help the future. Thank you, Cougars, for your kindness and generosity. Challenge Day will be held on Thursday, October 26th. This is your last week to turn in your permission slip. To participate in this amazing day, fill out a permission slip and return it to Ms. Chan in the Counseling Department by the end of today. The Hispanic College and Career Fair field trip is coming up on October 31st from 9.30 a.m. to 2 p.m. Permission slips are due in the counseling office. CSF applications are due tomorrow with a $5 application fee. Kids can turn them in to Ms. Blanton when finished. Kids who have received three A's and a B last semester can be eligible. Hey Cougars, don't forget that the songwriting club will be held today in the band room F4. Hope to see you there. Hey Cougars, are you working up an appetite? Here's what's on the lunch menu today. Teriyaki chicken with rice and burritos. Now here's John with sports. The girls varsity water polo team came up short against Notre Dame. The Cougars defense was strong with goalie Jennifer Marticelli having 12 blocks and 2 assists, the team having 10 steals total, and Raylan Shaliff having 2 field blocks. Lead scorers were Carly Hilvert and Mia Griffiths scoring 2 goals each. Casey Sorfleet and Julie Raffetto also each had a goal. The JV girls water polo team fell 6-5 against Notre Dame last night. This was their first loss of the season and their final game this year. Grayson Barmore, Maya Ripberger, Lily Nelson, and Holly Ebert all scored. Hope to see you in the pool next year, Cougars. Tonight is Dig Pink Night for volleyball. The freshman game is at 4, the JV is at 5, and varsity starts at 6. We have made many baked goods and treats that we will be selling at the games. See you there. Both football teams are back in action tomorrow as they host Menlo Atherton for the annual homecoming game. The JV kicks off at 5 and the varsity game starts at 7.30. The defending PAL champion boys wrestling team and top 10 ranked girls wrestling team starts its first official practice on Monday, October 30th after school. Sign up online at hmbhsathletics.com. Any questions, contact Coach Baker. Boys varsity and JV soccer tryouts begin on Monday, October 30th at 3.45 p.m. at the Cunha School soccer field. Please make sure to have your online athletic clearance and physicals completed and turned in to the athletic director prior to this date in order to participate in tryouts. Early release. Carolyn Benson, Maya Bliss, and Janelle Harris at 1.55 p.m. to help with volleyball setup. Varsity water polo, 2.30 p.m. Freshman girls volleyball, or freshman girls volleyball, 3 p.m. Girls Tennis, 3.15 p.m. Now, here's Mr. Olson with the Daily Trivia. Well, folks, the answer to yesterday's question was Brad Pitt. Congratulations to Mr. Reardon. In his fourth period class, they were the uh, fastest to answer. Mr. Reardon up here in K-Building, just down the hall from my classroom. Now, today we're going to make a bonus Thursday. We're trying to get the American League uh, fifth period uh, standings kind of equal with those fourth period points. So the points today will be doubled. And be ready, we might have kind of a difficult question about San Francisco restaurants. What do you know about restaurants in the city of San Francisco? Check your email for the question from me and have a, a terrific Thursday out there. Half Moon Bay High School.